In today's video, I'm bringing you the most broken MX Guardian shotgun class setup to use here in Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. Now, before we get into the class setup, if you guys are new to the channel and enjoy what you see, make sure you guys hit the subscribe button, also on those post notifications so you guys also like daily Mod 2 class setup videos. The other way, let's go around the class setup. Starting off the muzzle, I'm the X10 Modified Choke. Now, this gives us a tighter pellet spread as well as increasing that damage range. Now, those are two attributes that you really do want to buff on a shotgun. Now the tighter pellet spread will just give us like a smaller hip uh, hip fire radius, which is a lot better because then it just means that your bullets are more condensed and that your shots will hit a lot more efficiently and more accurate. And then the damage range is pretty more self-explanatory. Uh, just means like I was like cross mapping people on shot or on shipment with like three bullets with this thing, so uh, definitely definitely a good way to go. Two nail side is at a positive point eleven. Bottom side is at a negative or a positive point fourteen. For the barrel, I'm the HYPLM barrel, which improves the damage range, bolt velocity, recoil control, as well as hip fire accuracy. All great bonuses there. Uh, damage range, bolt velocity, again, like I just said, you do want to improve the damage range of this thing, and both of those kind of, of course, uh, play to that kind of play style. Recoil control is kind of needed here and there because I do have an attachment on that changes like the fire rate of the shotgun, so that's also nice. And the hip fire accuracy is pretty self explanatory as well because with the shotgun, most of the time you're just hip firing anyway, so. You need that as good as well. Tuning loss is at a positive 0.35. Bottom side is at a positive 0.13. For the rear grip on the Stream SK, which improves the sprint to fire speed as well as the aim on sight speed, you definitely need these two handling bonuses to very, be very, very good. Because with a shotgun, you are sprinting around the map quite rapidly, and the sprint to fire speed needs to be up there really, really well. Now, our only cons here are recoil control and flinch resistance. Flinch resistance, I find, is pretty irrelevant, especially when you're hip firing a lot, which you are with a shotgun, so. So I just find that very irrelevant. Tuning loss side is at a negative 0.87. Bottom side is at a negative 0.30. For the trigger action, I'm in the semi-auto trigger. This is like I said, I do change the, uh, this thing does come in full auto by default, but I did not like it full auto. I did level it up all like during with the full auto and I thought it was like just fine, but I threw this on and it is a game changer, I'm telling you. Uh, obviously you get a damage increase because of the high grain ammunition. And honestly, the semi-auto, literally all the other shotguns are like the same. And this thing, I don't care. I don't care if it's full auto. The semi-auto, you can still trigger finger it like crazy. So toss that on. And unfortunately, no tuning there. And put the magazine on the MX Pro Mag to give us, again, more aim on speed as well as sprint fire speed. To, again, improve the handling, like I said, which is very important with the shotgun. And again, no tuning there as well. But yeah, that's my MX Guardian shotgun class setup here in Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. Get you a double NV gameplay over on shipments. So hope you enjoy. If you guys do enjoy, wish you guys the button. I'll see you guys in the gameplay. Peace. All right, all right. Ah! All right. We got some hard point here today on shipment. And we are rocking the MX Guardian shotgun today. This shotgun's been in the game for like, what, two months? Three? Nah, probably two months by now. I think it's been two months. It might. Definitely two months. But I've yet to make a video on it because it took me forever to level it up. Well, not even like forever for me to level it up, but just, I just do not like playing this game. So, we're here. So let's see what we can do now that we finally have it leveled up. And of course, there's no better map to use a shotgun on than shipment. So we're gonna be that person in today's video. Someone's got to, someone's, there's always got to be that one guy that uses a shotgun on shipment, and, uh, thankfully it's going to be yours truly. I'm not going to lie, I leveled this thing up in the full auto the entire time, and I am so glad I'm using the semi-auto. The semi-auto just feels way better. Automatic shotguns are poop. The semi-auto's way better. Like, I don't care what anyone says. Oh my gosh, that guy actually almost got me there. That would've been not ideal. So we're relatively... I'm dead here. Oh, almost. Advance is leaving. And we're like two off this MGB. Guess I gotta go over here. There's one. Maybe a couple kills off now. Oh, we got it with the Semtex. Oh my gosh. The guy hit marked us with something. But the Semtex cleaned him up 
and we got the MGB. Holy. Got the MGB with the Semtex. That's wild. No way I just get stuck like that. Oh, man. Well, good thing about that, getting a new, uh, or, or an MGB early and then dying early. So we can uh, kind of run up this, the MGB counter, maybe. No way. Dang, man. We went crazy there. I thought we had it. No! Buddy's VTOL is poop. Now, speaking of DLC weapons as well, I still do not even have that FAMAS gun yet. The uh, Advance or whatever it's called there. I, like, I literally have yet to get that thing out of the Battle Pass. And I refuse, I refuse to buy the Battle Pass. So. I think I'm, I'm only like one tier away now though, so it's not horrible. But then I still gotta level it up. Advanced action. Mm, I, I'll take some long shots. I do already have this in gold, so. You, you can literally just get gold on this thing just for leveling it up, honestly. Like, the challenges for this thing are relatively fairly easy. Oh, and these enemies, like... They're in some... They're in a weird spawn pattern right now, and I'm not liking it too well. I am on a 20. I am definitely dead here, though. I'm out. I somehow got out of there, because... My teammate was bait. That shots are nice. Love to see that. Oh my. We're like a couple kills off now for that double. Yep, there it is. Juggernaut. And I'm dead again. Right after we got it, maybe. Hold up. Maybe? Give me my ammo. Oh, this gun. This game actually sucks. Like, look at this crap. I cannot pick it up because it's in the wall. Like, if I can't put it, if I can't pick it up because it's in the wall, don't put it in the wall, game. This game is horrible. Another long shot. No, I got out shotgun. Well, we got two MGBs. Can we get a third? Oh my. Come on. Oh my gosh. Get this decoy grenade away from it. Oh gosh, he's oh man, I'm getting out shotgunned. No, teammate, get him! Oh my clown. Oh, he threw on a riot shield on his back now. Oh, man, that is cringe. Thought I was going to make it out alive there. Unfortunately, I was wrong. Dude, this guy is just laying down in the most weird corners. No way, he's still in the same spot. Recon 
<laughs> that was a three shot from that range. What? What? But I can't do that? I got out shotgun by the same shotgun, though. I just hit that guy with the, the Semtex and he died. Literally, I stuck him with it and he died. Reload. This pack of loss in this game has just been absolutely brutal for me recently. Oh my gosh, teammate. Thought you were watching that. I was trying to call him my Overwatch Hilo. Pack of loss, pack of loss, pack of loss, pack of loss. Pack of loss, pack of burst, pack of burst, pack of burst. Love to see it. What? I think I'm Molotov. Dude, this guy has laid in that same corner. The same little crevice. Oh my gosh, it's someone else this time. Long shot. How do I not have this platinum? I feel like I've gotten a ton of long shots. I guess you do need like 25. Another UA. Just gotta keep the UAVs flowing, I guess. I don't even know what I was getting shot by there. No, my teammate was literally right behind me, was he not? That spawned me into that sentry right there. Lovely. Oh my gosh, there's only 30 seconds. Well, I guess we got a double, but... Ah. Definitely no triple. I'm gonna call this in. I I don't know. I don't want to test the waters by not calling it in, so. The sentry is shooting at me. What teammate? We'll be seeing the enemies. Holy. 170. The only enemy that I felt like that could stop me was the Cortez person with the fire shotgun that laid down in literally every corner that was possible. But other than that, I'm unstoppable. Truly what you'd like to see. 172 N16, double NGB with the MX Guardian shotgun. Baby!